David Ayer, what went wrong? What happened? Are you okay? All of these questions were going through my mind as I was watching The Taxi Collector starring Shia LaBeouf. I had really high hopes for this movie, seeing as David Ayer did Training Day, Fury, End of Watch, all of which I very much enjoy. And speaking of End of Watch, that I'm going to compare that movie to The Taxi Collector quite a bit. Because The Taxi Collector is your stereotypical buddy gangster movie that has a little bit of revenge and gang takeover in it. Plus, this movie is really, really boring. I found myself checking my watch multiple times throughout the course of this thing. And if you want to watch a buddy gangster movie, just watch End of Watch. Because the chemistry between Jake Gyllenhaal and Michael Pena, and that is way better than Shia LaBeouf and the character who plays David. That movie, this movie did nothing for me. I was like falling asleep. And it had these stupid slow-mo action, well not action, just these stupid slow-mo scenes that just slowed the movie down and I felt like we are just to kind of like pad time. I did not like this movie. This movie is, it gives you nothing. The acting is not great. The interaction between each characters and the chemistry that they have, also not great at all. Yeah, no, I don't know what David Ayer was on or what he was thinking when he was making this movie. I don't recommend watching it. The only reason I would recommend watching it is if it's like free and it comes on Netflix or something. Don't waste your money watching this. The Tax Collector. Three and a half beards out of ten.